It's not just the strong winds and heavy rain from a tropical system that you need to be concerned about. In fact, the most deadly part of a hurricane is the storm surge. Now, that's not the normal high tide that varies from day to day and place to place. It's the surge in advance of a hurricane, the surge of water, that a normal rise in water as a tropical storm is approaching. So we have these strong winds that are pushing that water on shore towards buildings, towards houses. Now, whether it's a tropical storm or a hurricane, that doesn't matter. But depending on the continental shelf, the slope of the land underneath the water's surface and the shape of the coastline, that can directly impact the significance of the storm surge. So whether it's three feet, six feet or more, water has a lot of force behind it. As a matter of fact, one cubic yard of water, that's three feet by three feet by three feet deep, weighs almost a ton, 2,000 pounds, and that's the force pushing the water towards land. Now, all of that water come ashore has debris in it, floats them and jets them, maybe cars and trees and boats and things. And this debris acts like a battering ram. And with everything rushing ashore, that battering ram is just going to eliminate anything in the storm's path. So storm surge is something you need to pay very close attention to.